What's that? You're going to have to put this on. I understand. Definitely. Whoa! That was a bit heavy. Is it uncomfortable for you? Don't worry, you'll get used to it. I've digitized the key and stored it in the backpack. Okay. Tab to open the inventory. Neat, I have a key. There we go. Uh, e to use item. Awesome. Press 2 to use the torchlight. Whoa, that's a bit... Br I'm a cat, what do I need this for? But <laughs> Can't I see in the dark? <laughs> wow, look at this place. I know, right? That elevator in the distance, that's important, I think. I know we need to go up. Boing. Whee! Oh, this is so cute. I love how he sits in the bucket with his little paws on, on the side of the bucket. It's adorable. I don't know, it's fun though. It looked pretty before, but now it's just disturbing because they're eggs, I assume. Bug eggs. Being a cat and all, it's what we do. No problem. Wait, I remember. The outside. It feels like I've been there before. Is this where you came from? Uh, no, this is a beach. I didn't come from a beach. I promised someone I would go there. Promised who? I don't know, come in. This postcard, the mural was printed from it. Let's take it. Feel like that's stealing. It might have been important to someone, but okay. Gain new item. I am sorry if that's a real language, but I don't think it is. For all I know, he's speaking Chinese. That's even more offensive, actually. Wee hoshi soshi. Sounds Chinese to me. And I've just committed racism. Try to attack me! Go! Go! Leave me alone! Eh. Um, he hit an alarm of some sort. And I can't run. This seems bad, but I'm sure it's fine. Oh, that's a bit rude. There's a cat, jeez. This is how you treat your god? This song is my jam. Come here, robot! You can't escape me! Treat me with some respect, damn you! Alright, you. You're not getting away. Why don't I summon my robot friend? I can speak to them. Come on, B12. I don't want to have to fight a robot monk. <laughs> it kind of looks like I'm going to have to. Oh. Well, well, well. If it isn't the robot monk, think you can stand up to a guard? Or are you just gonna behave like a human? Oh. Whoa, my eyes glue. They glue yellow. Don't mind if I do. Are you gonna pat me? That'd be really nice. I haven't had a good pat in a long time. I beg your pardon? They seem to have their own language. Oh. You're no Zerk. Achievement unlocked. Cat got your tongue? Ha, <laughs> nice. Cat ones. We're not familiar with your kind. You're welcome in our village as long as you don't eat anyone. You guys are robots. Why would I eat you? I'm a cat. Cats don't eat robots. Do they? I don't think so. What would I eat? Who would I eat? It's just a, it's a village of robots, right? Why, why would I eat you? That's such a weird thing to say. <laughs> Since when were cats predators to robots? I don't know. Alright, I'm a merciful guy. Despite all the disrespect, I will have mercy on you and not eat you. As I can definitely do, yes. I am capable of eating people. Robots. That's what I do. Are they people? They're wearing clothes. They're behaving suspiciously human-like. Which is weird. For robots. They are people who have uploaded their minds into robots. You look lost. What do you need? Show item. Postcard. Oh, a picture of the outside. Ridiculous. This elevator isn't operational. Everyone knows that it is impossible to leave this place. Well, except the outsiders. Well, I'm a cat, so... But they're all gone now. Except Momo. Momo? You can try to talk to him if you want, but... He gave up on trying to leave. It's for the best. He lives high up in that building with the orange neon sign. Of course he does. Where else would he live except a place with an orange neon sign that is clearly visible and highly convenient? Guess I'll go there then. Mind if I just... 
That's nice. That's really nice. Aww. Poor kitty. I gotta play with a paper bag. Curiosity killed the cat. Well, I hope this paper bag doesn't kill the cat. Oh. Oh. It gave me inverted controls. Thank. Oh, great. Oh, no. <laughs> Why? The store can't stop me because I can jump. Hello. Ah. That's a gay robot. Look at its face. Nice. See? Gay robot. Why is it a gay robot? Can robots even be gay? I don't know. I'm a cat. What do I know? I don't know nothing about being gay. Hi! Momo! It's never going to work. Why did I let them go? I'm all alone now. Hey you, what do you want? Uh... I want to drink an energy drink! Alright, oh, here, look at the outside. Picture of the outside? Do you want to go there? Well, don't bother. It's a waste of time. It will bring you only loneliness and despair. My friends had this dream too, but now they're gone and I'm all alone. I don't know where they ended up. I tried to contact him, but that freaking transceiver doesn't work. My friends and I took notes of our research about the outside. Here, take mine if you really want to go out there. Gained new item. Ruby. You're on your own. I'm done with the outside. Good luck. Thank you. Momo seems very sad. He misses his friends. Let me check the notebook he gave us. The outside is manifesto. We must go to the outside at any cost. We must protect our brothers and sisters. We must stay away from the Zerks. I think we should find the other notebooks. I agree. Isn't Momo meant to be a lemur? I don't know. Let's find the other notebooks. Alright, where to, B12? The symbol on the wall matches the one on the notebook. What symbol on what wall? What are you talking about? What are you, what? Oh, that one. That is a sad face. Or a surprise face, but I'm pretty sure it's sad, because the mouth doesn't join at the bottom. That seems like a lead. Take Clementine's notebook. Don't mind if I do. Groovy. And outside a notebook. It's the same as... It's the same logo as the one Momo gave us. This one seems to belong to someone named Clementine. Everything is going according to plan. We managed to contact the upper level before the transceiver went down. They are in a place called Midtown, and apparently it's controlled by some kind of oppressive force. Is that us? The cats? Probably. I talked to Momo earlier. His eyes... His eyes. I know this look. He will not come with us. Let's find the other notebooks. Take Zabazabazabaz notebook. Nice work. Another notebook. Thank you. This one belongs to... This one seems to belong to someone called Zabaltazar. Zabaltazar. He sounds like a demon. All trace of organic life has disappeared except for what we call the Zerks. They seem to be eating almost anything that moves and breed at an, an inconceivable rate. As if being locked in the city wasn't hard enough. Let's find other notebooks. Well, that's disturbing. Okay, that was a good bit of information. Good thing I'm a cat and therefore don't know what any of that means. Howdy, partner. Here you go, sheet music one of eight. Petite fowls. Sounds cool. Here, watch that. Do it. 
Finally, the last notebook. 